Yep. My name's Lee Thomas, and I'm an anchor and entertainment reporter for WJBK Fox 2 in Detroit. I've been on the job for well over a decade, and I am best known for my fun celebrity interviews. Is it because she won an Oscar or because she's unbelievably hot? He goes, hot. <laughs> <laughs> Would you dance with me? <laughs> they say that's my time. So far from Fresh Prince Day. I know you're. <laughs> you know, I be trying to mix it up a little bit, man. <laughs> trying to mix it up. If you were trying to describe yourself to someone Meryl Streep is, how would you finish the sentence? <laughs> a little heavy. <laughs> <laughs> that's all right. Nobody's perfect. No one is perfect. And little did I know, my biggest imperfection would become my biggest story. Here we go. When most people see me on camera, I'm fully covered up, fully made up, except for my hands are exposed, and they look different. Well, here's what I really look like. This is my face without makeup. I have a disease called vitiligo. I was diagnosed with it about a decade ago, and it's gotten progressively worse. In fact, one day, I may be completely void of color, completely white, but I'm fighting back. Ready, Lee? Yep. Here we go. Close your eyes. Uh-huh. Every little breeze seems to whisper Louise. Over the past five years, I've done various treatments, including the latest technology of life. Why am I telling my story now? Over the past few years, I've met or spoken with a number of kids and adults that have vitiligo. And many of them have told me that seeing me unafraid to be in the public eye and enjoying my job helps them. We're back on Larry King Live. The book is Turning White, a memoir of change. The author is Lee Thomas. There was Larry and Montel. Welcome Lee Thomas back to the show. I also got a little TLC. My book and my story have traveled the globe, and I've even started a support group with part of the proceeds of the book going back to a charity that I started. But this journey has turned into so much more than a guy with the disease. It's a life-changing, heartwarming mission as I show myself unmade, unclothed, and unafraid for the whole world to see.